Welcome to The Parley Unplugged, a podcast brought to you by the Museum of Sticks and Stones, an initiative of Metalsome. We invite you to join us for our inaugural season where we'll cover a range of topics from understanding what hate is and how it manifests in society with Metalsome's co-founder, William Smith Stubbs. Hate is human. It exists in all of us and it is just part of how we're wired. You can't expunge that from the human existence. It, it, it's there for a reason. But where it goes wrong is when we don't actually acknowledge that. And then it emerges in different ways. Online bullying, in-person bullying, hatred, racism, war, all these things that emerge from hate. And hearing the origins of the concept of Museum of Sticks and Stones. The Museum of Sticks and Stones is the flagship initiative from our nonprofit, which has spent over a decade working in the space of mental health. We have last couple of years decided to look into the problem of hate and how hate impacts people's health and well-being. You'll also hear about some techniques about how to manage your stress response when using digital spaces, techniques on how to handle difficult conversations and some of the frameworks Moss has developed from Moss's well-being designer, Dr Pre. We have a number of resources on our website and one of them is the field guide. We've added a lot of reflection exercises on there to really understand what kind of person are you online. We've got a number of archetypes um, that we've derived sort of from research as well and it's all about reflecting but also looking at how we can navigate complex conversations online and what happens when we experience stress online. What's actually happening in our mind, in our body and how to navigate that. You'll hear further insights from interviews with our previous debaters from live parlay events. It was such a safe place and I think that the way that the that the conversation was set up and, and that we were allowed to participate, both sides were not only open to what the other had to say but curious. The part of public discourse and the actual opportunity to do it was, was great and the audience as well, people that I know who came along and just witnessed it and people who had different viewpoints coming into it or maybe weren't certain how they felt about it, to hear both sides and for them both to be well articulated and rounded and consider it. I think people got a lot out of that. There must be a lot of people, I feel like I'm the same, generally quite agreeable. We just like to keep the peace. But when we're forced to be in a combative environment, it's probably quite therapeutic in some ways because you're not bottling it up. And lastly, you'll also get an in-depth exploration of the future of Moss and their plans to tackle what's being coined the universalism of hate with their project lead, Trisha Rogaju. Our long-term vision with Moss is to actually build a physical space where people can come and understand the mechanics and reasons why we create hate and harm and also see the humanity behind the human race, things around love and compassion and the times where people have united or um, experienced, you know, true beauty or things like that. So we want Moss to be something that not only Brisbane is, I guess, known for, but helps people to really build capacity to understand why we create hate and harm and how to manage that for their own mental well-being. So take a seat and settle in as together we explore how we as humanity can manage the very human experience of hate and harm. I'm your host, Ashwin Sedka. Are you ready to parlay?